Hey, y'all. Welcome back. I, uh, I know I didn't do the uh, live tonight. Y'all, I had just came in, and it was late. And um, I've been out down there working at the uh, booth all day. Well, not working there, but putting some stuff up. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I almost lost my... I almost choked. Anyway, I uh, was in the garage pulling through stuff all day, going through, trying to get the rest of the stuff to go down there. And it was raining. And my body just said, nope. Yeah, it just said, nope. That was it. So I didn't get a chance. But tomorrow, 7 o'clock Central, I will be doing a bag. I don't care what goes down. I will be doing a jewelry bag for y'all. But I picked up a couple things. When I was at the booth, I did pick up a couple things out of the Antique Mall in Allen. And, oh, I wanted to tell you guys, my store number, I mean, my dealer number, and that's what they say you ask for. If anybody's local and wants to go by there, um... It's 6591. I'm going to put it down in the description box, too. It's 6591 is the dealer number, and they'll show you. It's not fully done yet. I only have one whole uh, shelving unit full. I got the rest of the whole area to finish. And it's just taking me time because, um, as a lot of you know, I'm disabled, and I'm doing it by myself. And it is a lot of lugging, pulling, and it's been killing me, y'all. This has been a week and a half. And on top of that, like I told y'all, one of my best friends in the world, um, back from New Jersey, she actually lost her child um, this week. And um, I was extremely close to her child. And um, it's been difficult this week. That's why i kind of been a little quiet. And I just feel for her because um, I know I need to be on standby for her. So if you guys could just drop an extra prayer and um, just pay, pray for peace for her. And that's all we could do at this time is pray, pay, uh, pray for peace. And I wish I could be there. I couldn't even get there. So I just, so it's been a week. But anyway, let's get back to, I got, I stopped past um, St. Vincent's. They sent me a 40% off coupon. And I said to Tammy yesterday, I said, nope, I'm not going there. I'm not thrifting. And y'all, Thrift Giant Mill Street in Louisville. They had like a lot of antiques, uh, big sale for antiques or something today they sent me. I didn't go. Like I was not into thrifting. But when I left the um, an the antique mall in Allen, I just went on down Greenville, <laughs> cut down park and went to St. Vincent's. Yes, I did. I was guilty. And, and another thing is I wanted to go there to the little Chinese buffet thing where you could go fix and buy, take takeout. That's what I had for dinner. And it's right next to me. So what's a girl to do? But anyway, you know what? I'm going to show you what I got from the antique mall first. And um, just about everything that I got from St. Vincent is probably going to be for sale. Um, I really don't need it. I mean, I got... I'll show y'all. Anyway. Oh, now I was going to start with this. This was from St. Vincent. i got to find that, y'all. But look. Frosted martini glasses. Now, <laughs> I just said everything is going to be for a sale. Probably not these. It was only two, and I got them. Now, their glasses today, any kind of um, glasses or mugs, drinking glasses or mugs, um, was four for $1.39. And then I had a 40% off thing, but which they had for the whole store today, actually. 40% um, off, so it was 40% off for four pieces. And it was, um, so it was what, like uh, 40 and what? <laughs> 40 and it was like 40 something cent off, 44 cent off or something like that. 45 cent off. So a dollar and 90 cent, 92 cent or something like that. I mean, uh, 92 cent. Where well, I got a dollar? Y'all, you know how I am with math. Anyway, like 90 cent, 90 cent for four pieces. So I got two of these, right? And that's in here. I don't, I'm not going to unwrap it right now because I'm going to get this done. I got two of these, and then I had to find two more things so I could get it off, you know, have the sale. Because if not, they charge you the regular price. And so let's see if I can find them. What I got. No, that's what I was looking for at first. That's it. Anyway, I'll show you. Nope, that ain't it. Yo, this is not going the way I planned it. I wanted to show y'all the. Anyway, I'll show you what else I got. But I got those two. And then, look what I found, y'all. Wait till y'all see this. Do you see that? These were $1.39 per, and I got four. They had four of them sitting there, right? Is this Pyrex or is it? I didn't even look. 
Uh, yes. No. Y'all, I don't know. D Y N. I don't know what this brand is, y'all. I don't know. I'll look it up. I'll look it. Because I look like a fool trying to figure it out. It looks like Pyrex, though. Dinaware. I don't know who it's by. I never heard of it. I thought it was Pyrex when I glanced at it in the store. It looks just like it. I'm going to look it up. And you know what? If I find out this is part of uh, Pyrex, I'll put it in the description box because I didn't even notice that. When I looked, I seen that. I looked like PY. I said, oh, Pyrex. But anyway, I got four of these. And they were $1.39. So what's that? About $0.92, cent, something like that. $0.92 cent for uh, each. I got four of them. So not bad. They're cute, and I just seen, you know what I seen when I seen these? Now, not that I got four people to cook for, but how about little personal macaroni and cheese to sit when you do your table, right? thought that was so cute. I got so much stuff I'm still trying to price out, and I got stuff sitting around me, but it's in order. That's the thing. I know what I'm doing now, and it's not um, all stuff all over the place. So, yeah, I got four of those, and then um, that's another one of those. Trying to find those other two pieces that I got. Okay, they're not in here. So I got four of those, and then I got more stuff in here. Okay, it's probably in here. And then I got uh oh, and I got more glasses. Yeah. So then I got these. The other glasses are going to come up soon. Got stuff all over the place. Look at that. You see the, the um, look at that gold and black. Look at the vent, the, the age in this. This is so mid-century modern. Now, it's not doc, it's not, uh, nothing's written on the bottom on the glass, but I'm going to look that up. I can almost guarantee you this is mid-century. I have four of these. They were $1.39 a piece. However, again, like I said, all drinking glasses and mugs were four for $1.39. So I got four of them. So that meant it was $1.39 for all four, plus it was 40% off of that. So like 90 cents for four of those. Not bad at all. And then with those, with these here, because I only got two, I had to find two more things, and I found these milk glass mugs. Again, nice age to them. But these are probably 80s. I want to say probably 80s. Um, it's corning wear. And I'm going to say probably 80s with that. Look at those blue flowers. It takes me right to the early 80s. So really nice, though. Nice milk glass mugs. Really cute. I love it. Got two of them. So... You know, I had to get something so it could all be, or else they would charge me $1.39 for both of those. Yeah, so that's all I got in there. And then I did get something else from there, but I'm going to go to the antique mall. I'm going to show you what, what I got from there. Okay. thought these were so cute. They wrap stuff so good there. Okay. Y'all are going to say, girl, why? But that's what you're going to say. Why, Joan? Why are you doing this to yourself? Yeah, they wrap in tape. I love the way they wrap stuff there. Look. Is this cute? You know I love my asparagus, right? And no, I am not dealing. I'm not going to. I might leave a little asparagus out because it's not going to interfere with the lemon. It just looks green, you know. I might leave because I love asparagus. Um, you know, ceramics. I just love it. This is salt and pepper shaker, y'all. Look at that. And it's like that. Salt and pepper. You know I love my salt and pepper shakers. And yes, I do have lots and lots of these vegetable, ceramic, um, asparagus, salt and pepper shakers, asparagus and broccoli. I got them all. Yes, I do. But I've started some kind of little mini collection. That, so look at that. Just imagine that sitting there like that. And then you need your salt and you need your pepper. <laughs> Y'all, this was $5. They took the tag off, but it was $5. And, of course, you know, there was no sale with this. But $5 wasn't bad for that. Cute. And that's the difference. When you're buying at the antique mall as opposed to thrift store, you're like, girl. I'm like, I would never spend that. But I want to support people, you know, there. 
so. But some of the stuff, I saw a Le Creuset pitcher and pie plate today. Gorgeous. The pitcher was $30 and the pie plate was $32. I ain't that friendly. Nope. I said no. Now, you know I love my Le Creuset, but nope. I ain't doing it. Okay. Now, this, they took the tag off. However, and I just noticed one of his ears was broke. Can I break it? Nope. That's okay. Dang. It had to have, it was there. So, it, it had to be in this bag. If I could find it in the bag, I'll glue it back on. Because his ear was on when I got him. But look at this. Somebody messed around and glued this to the plate. And I'm going to get it off with nice hot water. But this is by, um, who is this by, y'all? Somebody collection. I don't know. But it was selling somewhere for $12.99. This would be the salt shaker. It's cabbage. Look at that. With radish on it. Look at that. Is that cute? And look at the bunny. As the, uh, and it sits on a little plate. They got glue stuck on here. But I'm going to get it off. And then look at the bunny as the pepper shaker. And his ear got to be in the bag because it was there. So, got the stoppers. I just pulled that stopper out. Look at that. So, they had the glue sitting on there, but I could take it off. Salt and pepper shakers with the little platter that it sits on. A little cabbage leaf. Look at that. And it originally sold somewhere for $12.99, but I paid $5 for it. Why does this sound like it? Oh, this thing is falling out. I'm like, why does it sound like it's making... No, it sounds like something's in there. Oh, okay, this stopper. They got an extra stopper in there. They got an extra stopper for some reason. I don't know. I'll get it. But I thought that was so cute. Look, poor little bunny got his little ear off. It's got to be in that bag. I'll get it. So cute. And all it's going to take is a little bit of glue to put it back on there. Clean break. But, yep. So, then, the last thing I got, and this was from the, um, this was $5, too. Again, from the um, Antique Mall, where I got the little booth at. And it's coming along. And, um, as soon as I get a little more done, I'm going to show y'all some video of it. But, it's just, oh, this is, I don't know if I showed y'all this. If you have the, um, they brought back these dishes to Dollar Tree. Not the lemon, not the cherry. These. Now, I have this set, but last year, in my area, we never got the salad plates. We got the bowls, the plates, um, the drinking glasses, placemats, towels. We got all of that, but not the salad. So, I got salad plates because I know I have this set packed in the garage. And I just got them so I can have a full set. I love these. These are so nice. I actually did a, put a video, I, um, put it on Facebook of it, because it came back as a memory when I did small space dining and used these Dollar Tree plates for, with a little teeny table for, um, you know, for people who had a small space saying they couldn't decorate. That was a fun little video. I did that last year around this time. So it came up as a memory. Um, okay, this is the last part. This is it, y'all. I'm so out of it. I hope y'all just forgive me, y'all, because I'm just torn out. That means that when I told you, I can't wait to soak in that tub and go to bed. All right, I got four of these plates. And this, you see the flower on here? I don't know if y'all can see that. Wait a minute. Here's a piece of it. Let me use that. See, bright white. Can y'all see that flower? Right? I'm, I brought these only for DIY purposes. Only for DIY purposes. Uh, this has to become a color. So I'm going to spray the back of this. And I'm actually going to take the time. Now, it will not be this week because I'm still working on trying to get that thing done. But I promise that I am going to do these. And I don't know what color I'm going to use yet. But I'm going to do a color. And I was thinking maybe I would do a metallic in here. and I don't know. But then again, I'm, maybe I'll just do um, just one simple color. And um, do salad plates. And I'll show you how I bake them. And then they come out where you, they're lifelong. You know, you don't have no problem with them. But I got them for that. So I got four of these. These were 69 cents a piece with 40% off. 40, yeah, 40% off. So I want to say they were like 40 something cent, 43 cent. I don't know, something, y'all. And then, so yeah, I got four of those. 
And then I got, oh, I got four or something else. Oh, four of these. And it's the same thing. But look at these, y'all, with the cabbage flowers. You see that? These cabbage flowers. I don't know if y'all can see that. It's the cabbage -y flowers. And I'm thinking these might become some type of a pastel beautiful um, bowl. But then it's frosted. I don't know what I want to do. I don't know if I want to paint it or I don't. I don't know, y'all. But I'm going to think. Because it, when I got them, my intentions was to paint them. But then as I was thinking more and more, as I got up to the register, I was like, I don't know. These were $2.49 a piece. So I don't know if I'm going to, but they were 40% off. So I wound up spending a dollar and 49 cents for four, um, a piece. I got four. So $6. Now, you know, I like these. These are just gorgeous, gorgeous salad bowls. Look at that. Gorgeous. So I got four of them, but that's it. That's all I've been up to. I haven't been doing a whole lot. And both of these sets of plates I want. So what what am I going to be thrifting, taking to the place? This. <laughs> That's it. I'm going to take these down there and put these up for sale. Other than that, I like my salt and pepper shakers, both sets. I love these. So I can't get rid of these. I love my frosted martini glasses for a table of two. I don't. Yeah, I think I'm keeping everything except for these. That's the only thing that's going to go. So, back to my old habits. These, these might go too. These corning, maybe these will go. Because how much were these? 69? Yeah, I'll, um, because, oh, no, no. These were probably only like 20 cents. Yeah, because I got four, four. Yeah, these will go. I know I could put these up for sale for a dollar, a couple dollars, two dollars. So, I'm done. I'm going to go to sleep. Take me a nice long bath and go to sleep and wake up and finish marking this stuff right here up. And then I got to get back around to the garage, go back through that and load up more over there. And then tomorrow night, Sunday night, um, seven o'clock, we will do our jewelry bag. And I hate that I missed tonight, guys, but I just, I really don't, I don't want to be out of it the way I'm feeling right now. And I couldn't really be involved in the live. It's senseless to do that. That's just a bad, best bad practice to try to go live and I'm not even feeling it. Because then y'all would feel, y'all would pick up on that, you know. But anyway, I will um, talk to you guys later. Thanks a lot for watching. I made this way longer than I needed to, but I missed y'all. Anyway, bye. Oh, and listen, all the new people that's popping on, thank you. Oh, I appreciate y'all. And um, listen, if you can meet us tonight, I mean, tomorrow night, 7 o'clock Central, for the live, we'll introduce y'all to all you new people to the um, group because we're just a whole bunch of fun. All right, guys, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye-bye. Oops.